This is the final solution for Gantt Mash Day 4. On Day 4 we actually added the ability to lose. If you miss Gantt 5 times on any level, um, you lose the game. We also added notifications. So in between the levels it will say level 1 completed, click below to start level 2. Um, if, it's, if you lost the game, it would say game over, please click start to try again. We also changed the backgrounds. Each background now has, each level now has a unique background. And we also lastly added in our, when you win the level, it actually plays the Mario you win sound. Or when you lose the level, it plays a game over sound. So let's play it, let's see how it works. So you can see my background changed. Also my music changed. Oh. One more hit and then I should see a notification that says congratulations you won level one. Um, the background should change. Level two obviously also should change. There's the, you want the level music. You can see level one completed. Click start below to start the next level. I click start, you can see the background change for level two. You see Gantz moving a little bit faster. And up here you can see level two. Again, you can see level 2 completed, click below to start, I click on start, you can see my background already changed, you can see this is level 3. There's my win the level music again. Go ahead and click on start because we completed level three. You can see the background changed. Gantz moving a lot faster. This is level four. I'm probably gonna lose on this level. If I miss five times, remember it should say game over and play game over sound. You can see game over, click the start again. And you can see the game is over. I'll we'll go ahead and click start. It starts me back over. This is the final example of day four. Gantt Mash completing it in class. Make sure you turn it in on your portfolio.